This is Dot Survivors, a complete game developed by me using Unity's data-oriented technology stack and their entity component system, and it's available right now for free on Steam. But Dot Survivors is more than just a game. It's also a massive learning resource to help you learn how to create a full game using Dots and ECS. Over on the Unity Asset Store, you can purchase access to the full project files, which include all source code written by me, as well as all of the art and audio assets developed by Syl and Emil of Penzilla Design. Now, I think they both did a tremendous job on this project, and I'll leave some links to their website down below if you want to hire them or purchase some of their asset packs. So anyways, the full project files for this game, Dot Survivors, are all available over on the Unity Asset Store. Uh, by the way, there is a two-week launch discount happening right now where you can get the asset for 30% off. And if you are interested in purchasing this asset, I would definitely recommend doing it now because I don't know when it's gonna be going on sale again. Now, when you purchase this asset, I'm not just gonna you know, give you the project files and leave it up to you to figure everything out. Um, included with these project files is access to a large documentation resource that includes written documentation on a few dozen of the most important concepts in the game dot survivors. In each of these sections of the documentation, I go over the decisions that I made and how it fits into the overall structure of the project. Now, if reading through documentations isn't really your thing, on each of these sections, I also have a video overview where I'm going over the code as well as editor configurations for each of these concepts. There also is a whole API section of the documentation that details every single one of the custom types that I created for this game. Um, so if there is anything in this game that you want to learn about, you can go into that. Now, there definitely is a lot of documentation to go over, and I certainly don't expect most people are going to be reading it cover to cover or watching every single video, but I wanted to really document the entire project because I really think that everyone is gonna find something interesting about this project. You know, certain people are gonna to wanna to know how certain aspects of the combat works or how the level progression system works or even how to integrate ECS with user interface. So I just wanted to have all that stuff available for whatever that you're interested in, you can find some good information on that. Now, I will say that for this project, it's probably a good idea to have at least some fundamental understanding of dots and ECS and just just kind of like some of the you know core APIs and kind of how you structure things in a project. So if you're not quite there yet, good news for you. I actually just posted a big five hour long tutorial today where I go into creating a simplified version of a survivor's type project. So this goes into just some of the very basics of setting up character and enemy movement and having some interactions between the enemies and players and all that. And so I think that tutorial is going to be a really great introduction into just give you a fundamental understanding of the API for DOTS and ECS projects. And then, you know, diving into the full asset store project, you're gonna have a lot more context and understanding about how things are kind of set up generally, and you can really learn a lot more from that. So um, again, go check that out as well. Um, but at the very least, at least just go download the Steam game. It's available for free, and I think it's pretty fun to play. Um, I'm really proud of this project. And again, I do just want to reiterate that this is a full game that I wanted to you know, put out on Steam. This isn't just some simple little tech demo or you know, some of the other types of tutorials that I may have made in the past where it is you know something very specific and focused where I'm you know developing a small project in a short amount of time and showcasing that um, no this is something that I actually wanted to you know make a complete project for where I do kind of make in some considerations about how certain aspects of the project are going to scale and of course you know integrate that with all the common features that you would expect out of a modern game so I'm extremely proud of this project and I really think that it's going to be a great learning resource for you all and you know really the idea with this is I wanted to showcase what goes into creating an actual game with dots and ECS you know I wanted to showcase all the awesome things that unity dots and ECS do but also you know highlight some of the areas where it's not so great and we have to do some weird and annoying workarounds and I really wanted to make sure that all that stuff is documented in there as well um, and by the way, I should of course mention that, you know, because this is a very specific type of project, this, you know, survivors type project, not everything in this game is going to apply to all types of games that you might want to make. However, I feel like that, you know, through this documentation, I did kind of a good job of explaining 
about the decisions that I made and why they were appropriate for this project. So hopefully that can at least give you some context if you are considering making a game with dots and ECS of your own to kind of factor in some of these different things into your decisions of how you want to structure things in your game. So anyways, if any of this sounds interesting to you, definitely go check out Dot Survivors over on the Unity Asset Store. Um, remember, we are doing the two week lunch discount for 30% off right now. So definitely don't miss out on that. So anyways, that's about all I have for today. Um, this Friday, however, I am going to be doing a live stream, just kind of celebrating the launch of Dots Survivors. Um, so we're doing a little episode of the Hot Path Show. And on here, I'm just gonna be available to you know, further discuss any aspects of the game and asset store project and answer any questions that you might have about it. So thanks for watching today's video and hope you learn a ton from Dots Survivors.